style that is rich and natural here. I seem to have been dropped down into a forest somewhere. The jelly shot us down in our plane of flesh. Um, I should have a book of supplies somewhere, I say. Um, ah, over there. Okay. What do we have in here? A couple of stone pickaxes, some oak wood, and two apples are oh, no. I can't eat them now, I'm not very hungry. I shall take this, it can be useful later, and I shall take the torches. Well, this seems like it's the edge of the desert, I say. Um, I shall gather some supplies from these trees over here and see what we shall decide what to do after that. This is a rather large British oak tree. We must be somewhere in Normandy, I say. We shall fight them on the beaches in the fields, and I can't remember what that speech was. It was such a long time ago, in 1940 something. This is a rather large tree, I say. Well, I shall just leave it floating. Look, it's the Nazi jetty. Scientific secrets over here. Look, they've made it so the trees can fly. I say. They have ravaged the land. Well, we shall. One of Jerry's henchmen. Let's kill it. Take its vital information. It's a spy. Vital information. Some ham or bacon. <coughs> Just needed to clear my throat there. I say. Ah, water, I think. No. A cave. A bunker. Well, we shall see what Jerry has hidden in here there. The place is reset. Nothing. Looks like Jerry left her. Why well, the large cave system down here? Probably for one of their their secrets, testing a secret weapon of some kind. Ah, experience, money, good. Coal is what runs the British Empire, so coal we must get. Without coal, we would not be as strong as we were. I say, there's rather a lot of it here. And there's some iron over there, but it's in a very precarious place. I will be especially careful when acquiring it. There we go, made the trap. My knees aren't what they used to be, you see. But, oh well. Go on, we must. Go on, we must. Nine pieces of Yes, ten. My counting was incorrect, my brain is what it used to be. Ten pieces of iron, I say. It's rather a lot in one, one go. I shall explore this cave system more. I heard a, a plane, plane engine. Must have been flying a or something, I say. I seem to be running out of torches. I will need to make more. Some sticks. Somehow this makes sticks, but it works anyway. Oh, damn it, I seem to have made too many torches. Oh well. Still won't need to make many more. Um, I must build my way across there. Um, would this be? What about if I just go and jump over? Ah, oh, that worked. More iron, I say. There's a rather rich mine down here. Jerry's secret won't be kept from us, not from the British Empire. The British Army, the British Air Force, and the British Navy. I 
I shall construct a mighty outpost behind enemy lines. Jenny won't know what hit them. My goodness me, this is very, oh, more, 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 I'd like to say. This is very deep indeed. My goodness, I don't think I should be staying down here for long. Rather damp. Not good for the lungs, you know. Living in a damp place, it can give you give you a cough or something. Flu isn't good in a war type situation. Must get every little scrap of iron we can get. Well, what does me? It's it's a decoy. This is a dead end, I say. I shall dig through it. Ah, no, this part was hidden. It must be the secret lair. Oh, another dead end, my, my god. Well, this isn't turning out to be very good. It's just a hole in the ground. Nope, nothing here. I shall find my way out again. I have more iron than I do coal. My goodness, that rarely happens. That really happens indeed. I shall go back up. And I shall swim up this waterfall. Yes. I shall look and see if I can get more coal from the uh, one of the other tunnels back there. That water was ruddy cold, I tell you. I won't be swimming any time soon. My god, it must be getting late. It must be nearly tea time, I say. I'm getting... A little bit pickish. But we must soldier on. And soldier on we must. Ah, more coal. Lovely. More iron. Lots more iron. My god, this is this is ripe with iron and coal. We feet the jackpot as they say. My god. Did I just hear a dog. Must be a wild dog or something, or maybe a stray. But I do not have any bones for him, sadly. Sounded an awful lot like a... a husky dog, or a big dog, not a little... little dog, big dog. All this back-breaking work is making me hungry. What, what do you say? I think after I'm done, I shall go and uh, eat one of those delicious apples I have. They do look very delicious. Hopefully they haven't got squished up with all that iron there. I believe it is getting brighter. Morn has come, I do believe. If not, it's just my failing eyesight, I mean. I am an old chap after all. Ah, yes. Some chicken. We shall have a nice roast dinner tonight. We shall eat. Oh, my, my goodness. My god. Sneaky Jerry. It's a spy. Sneaky Jerry. He will not come down here. He knows that he will hurt himself if he does. <coughs> I must clear my throat. My throat is dry. I must go and brew some tea in the cave. And by morn, I shall get up and about. I just heard a... What sounded like a very poisonous spider. I shall quickly... Construct a weapon of killing. It's getting closer. Where the devil is it? Now I need to quickly construct a weapon. I shall fabricate one from the very sticks and stones I've gathered with my bare hands. Where the devil is it? I shall keep alert. I... I wager it is past dinner time already. Uh, 
I believe it would... Yes, the best thing to do would be to stay in here and not go out in case we are assaulted by one of Jerry's henchmen, eh? If I see him, I'll give him a good kicking. Give him a good bash. Where the ruddy hell is it? It's mocking me. Devilish thing. I shall make my way up there. I shall construct a bridge of great integrity. A thousand soldiers will be able to march over it. It won't even move. Yes. British engineering yet at its finest. Looks like I was correct in my timings. It is most definitely past dinner time. In fact, it's probably time for bed. But I don't seem to have one around here. I shall... I shall mine this, actually, now. One can never be too cautious. I shall stay inside and defend the perimeter like any Englishman would do. We shall go out and explore like the pioneers of... Oh my goodness me. It's down there somewhere. That was very loud, I say. My God. Jerry! There he is. My God, he's... He cometh forth. He has friends. My God. I must retreat. Tactical retreat, I say. Quickly block it up. Jerry's plan was foiled, I say. By British engineering. Yes. One up for the British Army. One down for Jerry. I'm getting a little bit peckish still. I'm going to construct a mighty furnace to smelt all of my iron into glorious, usable iron. And then we will build great British machines. Yes, sounds glorious. And we could cook some, uh, cook some pork too. Lovely. I say, you can hear them marching across the land above. I am most definitely deep within enemy territory. Ah, I heard a chicken. Now we know they have farm animals here. I can hinder hinder their advance with the uh, by taking their livestock. Yes, sounds like a good idea. It is one's duty to do as much damage as one possibly can to the enemy, even if that includes stealing their food from their bellies. I must construct a mighty axe so it is easier to break or dismantle this crafting bench here. That devilish spider is somewhere nearby but I can't pin exactly where. My god, it's stealth. The stealth one is probably some kind of reconnaissance sniper or something. Jerry. He's on to us. I can smell it. Well, I can actually smell cooking iron, but that, yeah, that, yeah. That's nothing. Damn that, Jerry. There he is. My God. They are marching. We must not let them take Britain. 
They will not land. I will not let it happen. Ah, hardware. If I were to be, if I were to be killed now, it would be a disaster for England and Britain and United Kingdom and the nations united against Jedi. My God, two of them. I am outnumbered. My God, friend of fire. I say. Ah, we have him. Our first Jedi account killing. I shall take his body away. Is to not to alert them. Here yeah, we have cooked up a hearty breakfast of pork and bacon for one to eat heartily. One must always eat a, a large breakfast as so to fuel him throughout the day. Now we can leave this place in peace. My god, Jerry. Oh dear.